Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. Today we'll be taking a look at the Edifier MP255 Bluetooth speaker. As you can see here, this speaker is rated IP54. So yes, it is splash proof and you can bring it into the shower if you want to. So the unboxing experience is a bit weird. They have this kind of seal uh, that's covering the notch and the lever there. So you have to pop that open and then once you remove it, you'll find two silicon pads at the top that protects the speaker itself from getting damaged or moving around during transportation. And all the accessories are actually located beneath the speaker itself. It's actually a sort of container type of thing. Uh, Edifier is overly designed, overly intricate in this type of packaging and here you'll find lots of documentation and also the warranty card itself. So here you get a really short micro USB cable. Of course, this is indeed a Bluetooth speaker. You need to charge it. But of course, it's actually more than that. You can find out in our review, which is linked up above right there. So right above here, you have five buttons. You have the volume buttons at two sides, a call button, a play pause, and also the power button at the center. At the bottom here, you can see it's the MP255 and it has an input of 5 volts at 2 amps. So it is as powerful as an iPad actually. Opening the flap here, you can see a micro SD card slot and also a micro USB port, which you can actually plug in your smartphone or your PC inside through micro USB and use it as a audio pass-through since it does not have a 3.5mm headphone jack. So here's me turning it on and you can hear the beautiful sound that it makes. Here's a short little demo. To be honest, the MP255 actually sounds pretty good. Um, the bass is there for a Bluetooth speaker of such size actually. It's loud, uh, there are no distortion, the sound quality is a bit heavy on the bass side, but overall, it's a very nice speaker. Uh, you do have a bit of extra features like uh, audio pass through USB, and then you also get a card reader function, which is very uncommon to see if not the first time. Do tell us if you like this video and uh, do subscribe for more videos like this in the future. Thanks for watching, and I hope you have a nice day.